corner. That looked like he was heading into the secondary and evaded the free safety. With everyone standing at Dodger Stadium, Kershaw pitches. Carpenter swings and hits a drive. Right center field. It's in the gap. And it's down off the wall. Molina scores. Adam scores. Jay scores. Carpenter. He scores three with a double to right center, and the Cardinals lead seven to six. What an at bat by Carpenter. And now the I didn't mean to push there. Uh, okay. And he's right to the wall. He's there. He squeezes it, and the A's have won it. Three. <laughs> Postseason for the Oakland A's. Yeah. Both teams getting their final warm-ups in as we welcome you back to the MLB pregame show. First pitch of game two in our series is right around the corner, but before we turn that corner, here is our Topps player spotlight. Sir Dudenstein, his dudeness, is in that spotlight. And the past month or so has been very kind to this emerging star as he's been posting some really impressive numbers. For more, let's turn to Steve Lyons. Well, thanks, Matt. You know, many people know of him by now, but everyone's going to know his name if he keeps playing like he has of late. You know, coming into this season, he was seen as a young, up-and-coming player who could be a real superstar in Major League Baseball once he fully developed. But he looks like he might be hitting that stride a lot earlier than we all thought, because right now, he's performing on an elite level and has arguably been the hottest player on this team. Now, I suggest paying attention to him in this game because we might be witnessing the coming out party for baseball's next great star. Okay, we're looking forward to this one. Lineups and first pitch on the show coming up next. Tuesday night baseball on the show as you get a look there at Rogers Center here in Toronto. The calendar has turned to September and we're ready for baseball between the Eastern Division leading New York Yankees and the Toronto Blue Jays. Sir Dudenstein, his dudeness, will get his first opportunity here to take a look at how he's fared versus this arm to this point in his career. Swing and a ball hit on the ground. Oh, and no time to get him. Yeah. Beat it out. It's sort of like a swinging butt. This doesn't lead to a run. It's important not to let this guy get out there and skate through the first inning, throwing as few pitches as he has. If nothing else... Maybe you force him to throw another, I don't know, five, six, seven pitches to the next hitter. Play phase, Jack. As well as always. Yeah, I like puts up with them sometimes. Like, hey, don't I don't know. Sorry, but other people. And like, I don't always like, like, Mets in there getting involved, but seriously. Some assholes out there, seriously. And here's a ball hit in the air. I don't even know this, you know, the person's story. Like, like a wide iron play, like, there's a reason. I mean, if you listen, actually watch the cast and actually listen to the stories he tells, tells how he ends up. Maybe you actually would know instead of calling him something like that. Just saying, uh, I hate people like that. Just all the full too many assholes. That, seriously, all the just way too many full full of assholes. I mean, what a chat. I'm just talking. Came out of nowhere. Pitch misses low. The throw down. Way so I'm gonna fix it. Just freaking like to be assholes out there. You've got to play with the mindset that no lead is ever safe. So that's a good job right there. Taking second and getting yourself into scoring position. Five runs on only four hits and no errors for the Yankees so far. That was a ball. I got way on there. The one one. Hit hard back up the middle, and that's in. Give me a signal. No, okay, hey, that's a good idea because he threw the second. But I didn't go there. He's gonna get a visit from the pitching coach here. 
but my goodness. They got a visit from the pitching coach, and then the manager came right out. I guess the I guess the guy wasn't warmed up yet. <laughs> find it ain't happening John Jack is going to take over here in inning number five as it's going to be up to their bullpen to try and keep them in the game here Sir Dudenstein his dudeness will get another shot now two for three in the game Dudenstein his dudeness First offering on the way. Now a ball lying toward the I mean, not the run the second on that play, but end up working out. Third hit of the night, and it'll be good for extra bases. Around third. Give me another run. Yeah. Runner will score from first. Well, that's what he's done well all season. The Mets swing the bat with runners in scoring position. He drives in another one here on the RBI double. Javi Guerra. Where's a pit kick? It sounds like they're trying to spell Mets a that's a plastic, uh, that's the hell of a man from Superman's name. It's a plastic, it's a black. I can't even say it. Sir Dudenstein. Uh, damn, that was, that is one complex name. Whoever was pitching the, that gave him the double. And the, in the, uh, in the last time it was up. And he just gets a piece there. That's a plexi. <laughs> What's your friend? <laughs> Kidding. Or Canada. What the hell? I not make a joke. I have no. I have no problem with my friend. My our Canadian brother doesn't know it. I make fun of myself as much as anybody on this show. Let's watch this. I don't know quite what the problem was. It just sort of looked like he clanked it over there. And yeah, sure enough, the throw's right there. He yeah. doesn't close the glove around. And guys, you can't win if you can't score, so there's probably not a whole lot of debate about who'll Yeah. I could debate it. <laughs> yeah, definitely no no debate as far as I'm concerned. No debate. Stop kissing the pitcher's ass, please. Oh, two coming. Swing and a fly ball toward right. Oh, he didn't get on that one time. I got on four of the five times with the air. Runner tags. He'll advance into third. Jackie Bradley, Superman in the alley. And how about the appreciation from these fans? A spectacular catch. Salvador Perez, the two-two. Can't even do anything about it yet. Get up a little bit more. Dude, I realize this when I turn the music off and listen to this. I think they actually use less sound to the game. Um, down to baseball. It did last year. I was saying when I said I was hoping they'd add more. They didn't use as many they did in 2014. It's like, really? I could be wrong, but it doesn't seem like they had the same amount as last year. Toronto and the Rogers Center, the home of this edition of baseball on the show. Today it's the rubber match of this three series. <laughs> Play the ones over and over again. His dudeness will stand in. He too had three hits in the win last night. Here's a ground ball to first. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And now. Save! Bad call! Bad call! I'd argue that one. One, two, three, go the Bombers. Yankees, nothing. I beat it. It's Major League Baseball on the show. Uh, Major, can you argue that one, please? Please? Back me up here. Now the first pitch. And oh, they'd look to catch him flush down near the foot or the ankle. 
Yeah, I got that. You weren't going to steal that one from me. I got that in time this time. Way more. You know, but you stole the one before when you called it wrong. But that one I made sure you weren't. I got there enough time before you. Or the fall did. Here's the first offering. Runners off for second. That one missed in the dirt. Go, is he going to go third? It didn't say it. Don't be didn't. The next pitch. He probably was through the third too if he had gone. That would have been a good. That would have been a probably a good idea to go third, but maybe slid. Who knows? Down low, two balls and a strike. And this is. Ooh, got away with one. There. Good hitters count. Yeah, it's not unrelated either. When you're going good at the plate, usually means. Meanwhile, this ball gets down. It's a base hit. The throw home, and that'll score the runner. Yeah. Ball game now. And on the play, the I smartly get the second on that play. Yeah. Take advantage of the throw going home. We'll lead it off here in the top of inning number seven. Dudenstein is Dudenstein. And he takes a big swing here, but this winds up a little tapper to the left of the mound. Throw is low, and he can't <laughs> get it to stick in the webbing. It should be three for th it should be four for four, considering the fact that my one non hit. I beat it to throw the first. Call whatever you want. He'll call it a leadoff single. But they called me out. I was looking like I was going to get up in the same inning there for a second. We were, we were, we were doing so good in the inning, but nope. Nope. Didn't work out that way. Where's the guy got... Guy's got the uh, legs the size of actual tree trunks. Him down on a knee, but if there's one thing I know about this guy, he will not want to come out of this game. And from all indications, it looks like he's going to try to continue. An entertaining game, all in all. So if we have to choose one who stood out among all others, why not go with this man right here? He's our top. Okay, you can have it. You draw him more than me, but yeah. What could be unusual about it? The clouds start coming on the field and start dancing. Do, 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 do. What? That'd be unusual. If <laughs> they want to get that way. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not the one who said unusual. Or I said just. <laughs> What the hell is going on? Oh. Okay, just looking at something. I thought it's something. Something's gone out news. Somebody pointing something. <laughs> Alright, he was down. And the scene? And again, the 2 2. And the bean down. Foul ground. Avila is under it. And they've done it. The Tigers have done it. For the fourth consecutive year, they are champions of the American League Central Division. <laughs> Welcome back. I'm Matt Vaskersian here on the MLB pregame show. As we draw closer to the first pitch in this series opener, let's have a look at our tops player spotlight. Sir Dudenstein, his Dudeness, is highlighted here 
And it's pretty obvious why at this point. He 